What's going on folks? I'm Johnny Bobby John Carl Roloff Dumpster Series. Today we're going to cover Grease and a Max Trailer Gooseneck Roloff Dump. We're going to show you where the grease points are, or at least most of them, and why we got to grease it. So you keep your, trouble, your trailer last a good old long time, So because you don't have no troubles out of it. We'll start right off in here. You got a few grease points for your jacks. One, two, those two right there. You don't want no problems out of those unless you want your jack to be squeaking. Those ain't no real big deal. But you can knock some out on there. Put a little grease in there. Then you have two more right here. But you can't a little dark in there. So one right there and one right there. Uh, that's cool. And then we're going to go on around. And we're going to get to ones that matter. Notice I have the safety bar up right here. So in case it falls, I guess it won't crush me all the way. to help me adjust a little bit. And uh, once we get in here, we got this big old giant transformer. As I like to call it. You got grease points all open here. So you have one that's right there, one is right there, on the top, right there, and right there. And then once you come back down, you're just gonna follow the, the arm. If you have one of these trailers, you know what I'm talking about. You have one right here. You wanna make sure that was good to go. And then you have one right here. Don't worry about it. When this thing needs some oil, some grease, it's gonna let you know. She's gonna be squeaking and hollering and crying, and she's gonna get on your nerves. So look here, then we got some more that's down here it's one up under here so I'm gonna take you around and around the corner and there's one right there and they have one right here and one right there now that's those grease points that's inside the actual trailer that we got to keep this thing in operational uh, condition and then you got to take these lugs off right here and you got you can once you pop that off on all four of your woods you got a grease bearing in there you want to keep that greased up as well on all four lugs the grease will start oozing out the sides now the little tricky one, if you look at this hinge, and we're talking about this hinge right here, folks, this one right here. So what you want to do, I'm going to get on up yonder, up under there, and you might be able to see it and you might not. It's right there. But to get to it, I'm going to spin you around, upside down, like we're on a roller coaster. Wee! Let's try that. That's all right. And uh, there's a little hole right there that you want to get in there. That's how you get at it. You got to let the trail up just a little bit. All right, sorry about the little effects, but I figured y'all want a little extras today. And uh, that's the main grease points that I'll find on this thing. Now, I wish they would have put some rollers down in here so the back ain't slide. So you don't got that good metal on metal slide when, you, when your uh, flatbed or your dumps is coming up on the trailer. So what I do is I grease this track on both sides all the way up to that T-bar. The one I'm pointing at right there. So guess what? That allows, it really helps the dumpster slide a little better. And also, I put uh, silicone all over the trailer to try to keep this rust down on these rails. Because you know what? These folks ain't use no Chinese steel on this trailer. I want this good American Carnegie steel. That's what's on here, y'all. They built this trailer right. They built it tight. Look at them Look at them wells. That's a man to know how to wheel right there. This ain't nothing that old knockoff stuff that we see around the corner and everywhere else. So uh, this concludes this segment on how to grease this trailer up, keep it up, and uh, it'll last you a long time, I imagine, or at least I hope it do. But uh, this completes this segment on uh, Johnny Bobby's Junk Call and Roll Off Dumpsters. I hope I taught you how to grease your trailer, and most trailers are greased the same way. Take care of your stuff so it'll take care of you. You're going up and down the road, you don't get nobody no problems running off, stuff falling all off the trailer, wheels falling off. That, you know, that just ain't right. Take care of people. Keep people safe. All right, I'll catch y'all later.